So before this video starts for Back to the Future locations, I just have to say that by the time that I made it to the mall, um, I didn't have a lot of time, so I couldn't go back to videos uh, like the movie, just to reference to make sure that I had the right spots. Um, so I'm not going to post too many of those videos. I'm going to try to at least find a video where I can at least show you like what the mall looks like for those who haven't seen it. Um, but anyways, um, but I'm not going to post anything else because it's kind of embarrassing. Like I really thought that I had it and I did not. Um, if you go to my Instagram account, I did post the pictures and someone corrected me and they're like, mm, honey, you're standing in the wrong spot. But I kept them up anyway, and you know I um, I did state that I, it was the wrong place. But at least you know I was at the mall. Like that is a filming location. So I hope that you guys still enjoy the video. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am headed right now to filming locations for the 1985 classic film Back to the Future. Woo! Really exciting. Um, I'm heading towards, uh, I think it's South Pasadena right now, to the Campbell House, which is actually Doc Brown's house in the movie. Um, so now I am in Pasadena, and I've just arrived at the Gamble House, aka uh, Doc Brown's house. Sorry, it's just so pretty. It's right there. Um, they actually do tours, but I think the tour just started at 12 and it's 12.15 now. Well, let's walk up, shall we? Sorry, I'm like trying to read that sign over there, so sorry if I wasn't focusing. Tickets and bookstore. actually use the ex interiors of the garage for the movie, but not the exteriors of the house for the movie, just the exteriors. And now this is a bookstore where you can get your tickets to tour the house. I suppose Jane Wyman is a first lady. Whoa, wait, Doc. And Jack Benny is secretary of the treasury. Oh. Doc, you gotta listen to me. I got enough practical jokes for one evening. Good night, future boy. No, wait, Doc. Doc, the, the, the bruise, the bruise in your head. I know how that happened. You told me the whole story. You were standing on your toilet. Tonight, and if you see those hooks on the ceiling, Oh, you're trying to just put up the 
think what the servants use against see how they treat the same yeah. The yeah. same book, if they contain yeah. it. at another location this was a little further out this is the Fuentes Hills Mall which is known as Twin Peaks Mall so um, I'm gonna walk outside and see if I can try to pinpoint exactly um, behind me I think not the Macy's but over there I want to say that used to be the JC Penney's that you would see in the background in the movie um, and then the entrance where you see him going up on his uh, skateboard is over that way. So I'm going to get off and see if I can do this. All right. um, and I hear now that it's being stored inside of um, close to Macy's. So I'm going to go inside and find it. So I'm inside the mall right now, searching for the Twin Pines mall sign. Um, I think it was moved from the uh, from the original location. She said it was by the Hollister, next to the ice cream shop. So let's see if I can find it. Okay, <gasps> I found it. So there it is. Marty McFly's house. How awesome is that? It's so cool that I'm standing right here right now. So to all my Back to the Future fans, especially my babe, he loves this movie. This is for you. Roads? Where we're going, we don't need. Roads. 